how long will it take? How long does it take? To cure my disease, to get back the signal, you know, whatever that signal, your, to get your negative medical test back, to get your, or whatever the signal is for you that you have cured this disease. How long before that signal comes? And how many times a day, how much during the day do I have to do this? These are the two questions that everybody asks. <laughs> so I figured I'd make a movie about them, you know, to just see what we could do with them. Because <laughs> that's what everybody wants to know, you know, these two things. Well, you hear these people in The Cure Show. And so you can hear them. See, in The Cure Show, you actually hear the person, uh, you know, the guest on the show with, you know, there's usually three or four volunteers that show up, you know, to, to do The Cure Show with, with the person on the show. With you, actually, if you, you know, if there aren't a whole lot of shows on your disease, we want to do more shows on, on most of these diseases. Because every single person on the show cures the disease. And they all do it in a slightly, each person does it in a slightly different way. So, you know, we want to keep demonstrating these variations because what you're doing when you're listening to the cure show is you're actually curing your disease by, by it, it, you don't exactly imitate what they do. Um, what you do is adapt it, you know, to you. And, and with a lot of diseases, it is sort of like an imitation, you know, job, because it's a, you know, it's a pretty, pretty literal, you know, thing. I mean, you, I mean, with herpes, you take it out of the spiral body and, you know, oh, yeah, maybe I should mention to you that this is weird. <laughs> like, you take it out of the spiral body. Well, how do you do that? And what's the spiral body? Like, already it's weird, okay? But the thing that's really weird is that people actually cure this stuff. This can't be. You know, you know we're talking about taking a disease that you may have been treated for all your life. Like I had herpes 28 years. That was, you know, the thing that my big first cure was, that's how we all discovered we could cure things. I cured my herpes. Uh, and there was no website, there was no, see this, see this book? There was no book. <laughs> you know, I just did it. You know, suddenly I got the idea, can I take my herpes out? Yes. We were doing it to feel good. We didn't, you know, we didn't know it cured anything. We did, I, I did this for like three or four months without ever realizing you could cure stuff with it. And, you know, after, and, you know, I'll tell the story about how I discovered it some other time. This is a YouTube movie, okay? So it has to be under 10 minutes. Because YouTube doesn't let you put up longer movies. So, but, you know, I, suddenly I got the idea to ask, you know, and boom. <laughs> that was the very last herpes outbreak I ever had. I, that was in 1993. It's now 2007. <laughs> I'm, I'm buyered, by the way. I was cure zero in the cure drive high. <laughs> I, uh, that was my cure that I went out when we, we started the cure drive in 2004. So I reported my herpes cure 11 years later. Very proudly went to the poll and reported. I had two her kinds of herpes, actually. I was cured zero and one. <laughs> okay, so what you're doing is you're, you're, you know, you're adapting. See, with some diseases, it's a lot more like with Graves' disease, it's going to be a lot more subtle, you know. With herpes, it's going to be a lot more literal. Flu is like people cure the flu in five minutes. You hear them on the, we have like 25 flu hotline shows where people call, the shows are like 15 minutes long and you can hear their symptoms disappear on the show. So, so this cannot be. This is the thing that's really strange about this. That there is this disease that you may have been being treated for all your life 
or you know you may you know it may be a disease like flu that they have spent i mean people routinely get their phd's studying flu there are tens of thousands of phd's were earned this way nobody has ever found a cure for it and i'm telling you you can cure it in 5 minutes that's weird that's pretty strange it is actually ludicrous the idea that you can do this is ridiculous you know lots of people have already turned this movie off because of that <laughs> that salient point you know it's like it ain't possible okay that a drug company might have spent 500 million dollars developing a treatment that doesn't cure it and i'm telling you that you can walk into the cure show or just listen to a bunch of cure shows and imitate what you hear and you know you're free of the disease it's it ain't you know uh uh <laughs> let me tell you something you know if somebody had told me this <laughs> see the thing is i'm the guy doing the telling now you know i'm the volunteer you know who gets to <laughs> i got the job you know cuz i you know i cured my herpes so and then i had to pay it forward <laughs> i got the job you know so here i am like i i get to buy a $500 camera but it's pleasant you know like i'm out here in a wildlife area where i come every day anyway so telling you but that's what it is you know that's what the cure show is and the answer to your question should be obvious i don't know did you watch the movie of the kids like remember the girl says like i'm breathing differently that's it you know that's how long it takes <laughs> what you saw the movie well, how long is the movie is what 4 minutes or something <laughs> so <laughs> Oh god. But you know the truth is that this this question of how long does it take and also um you know like how how much do I have to do this throughout the day and so on those are not good questions. And they should be replaced by another question. Like as you do what we're showing you how to do here you I'm assuming you're still watching the movie cuz what do I know you know whether you turned it off or not I'm a movie okay so I don't know what you're doing out there but um also it's good cuz if you're gone my, my feelings won't be hurt <laughs> I'm a movie you know but anyway um they should as you do this you learn how to ask better questions and i'm also realizing that i'm running out of time my 10 minutes <laughs> is almost up so you know what i should do is i should just make another movie and as you know which with the answer to this and as long as i'm making another movie why don't you see if you can convert these two questions okay into a question that's you know that's a lot more relevant okay so the two so the two questions are How long does it how long is it going to take to get my negative medical test and um you know how much do I have to do this during the day you know to cure the to cure whatever it is you've got why don't you see what you can come up with for a better question and you know then when you turn on the next movie you'll hear what uh, you know what I think about it you know all right I'll uh, see you over there